trading this grass block up to a private island. So far I've traded my way through all these things up to this caravan. Getting to the caravan was a really big step on the map and puts us in such a solid position to level up fast. On my way to see a Nissan Navara, I had a guy come this morning and actually look at the caravan and he's already very keen to do the swap. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to check out his Nissan Navara just to make sure it is what he says it is and uh, it's worth what he says it's worth. Uh, runs, it's, do, it's actually in good shape. <laughs> Hopefully, we'll be able to make a trade right now. We're in the streets. Ah, oh, that looks like it's it right there. Nissan Navara. Damn. She looks pretty clean. All right, so we got Nissan Navara. 2019, you said? Uh, 2009. Oh, sorry, sorry, yeah, 2009. Yeah. Sorry, my, my mistake. I tell you what, she looks pretty clean for a 2009, hey? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, it got repainted, but yep. a little bit foggy, as you can see. <laughs> Some bits that weren't done yeah, exactly they, right? They, they didn't do it correctly. Sure, gotcha. I got it from the dealership in Sydney. Oh, okay, cool. Hot hood? Yeah, okay, that'd be good. Thanks, mate. Let's tell you what, it's looking all right. Nice. Let's do it here. Oh, I missed, it. missed the bloody street, mate. I'll go over here, eh? <laughs> so, what made you want to be part of this with us? Oh, well, it's just like... <laughs> it's pretty crazy if you can actually do that. But, uh, <laughs> yeah, I, I think you'll be trading for a couple of years. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> we'll see, eh? Hey, we'll see. <laughs> Alright, mate, she's, she's as clean as I, I'd imagined and uh, runs just as well. So, if you want to do the deal, I'm ready. I'm, I'm ready. Yeah. Only minutes after we're agreeing to the trade for the Navara, Clint told me that we just had a cash offer for the Navara and for the exact asking price that we were looking for, sight unseen. So we decided to take the cash offer and cancel the Navara trade. Not ideal, I know, but we're doing what's best for the challenge to move forward as fast as we can. However, the buyer never transferred the deposit and we were back to square one again. But just a few days later, Clint, what's happening? You got any trades for us today? Yeah, g'day Grant. Uh, I'm just here about to board my flight. You know where I'm going. But man, it's been a rough week. It's been a classic. It's been a, it's been a really tough one. I've done so yeah. much outreach um, without a lot to show for it. Plus, for some reason, man, at this level, uh, we've been getting some very, very colourful replies in the uh, DMs. So it's been fun. And, uh, you know, they're kind of funny though. So check them out. Anyway, look. Um, I do have one promising lead. Uh, I'm very excited about it. I'll send you the details now. There's just one catch. They do not want to be filmed, um, which throws a spanner in the works, but we can make it work. Uh, so yeah, let, let me send that over to you now. Clint said they're looking to trade for a V8 Holden Caprice and are going to be here shortly. I tell you what, I'm pretty stoked that they're coming to me because I don't have a car that can tow the van anyway to go and show them. Uh, they're all actually already bringing a tow van with them or a tow car with them that can actually move the van. So I think they must be pretty serious about taking it with them today. So I'm going to get two grand cash out right now, just in case this all goes down right now. This could be a massive trade up if I can get it over the line because this V8 is worth a whole lot more than the caravan, even with the cash added to it. Okay, they didn't want to be on camera, but this is basically what happened. Hey mate, Grant. Hey bud, Ashley. Man, this is an amazing car. Why do you want to trade it for the uh, caravan? Well, let's just say I bought this car without my wife exactly knowing and she wasn't heaps impressed with it. All right, I know who wants the caravan then. You got it. All right, we'll check out the van, see what you think. Yeah, we will do. Take the car for a test drive if you Definitely, want. Definitely, yeah, for sure. Nice. Leather interior. Very luxurious. Man, this thing's got some power. Listen to that rumble. Six litre V8, nice. Hopefully he wants to trade for the van. Well mate, I'm definitely keen to trade too. This thing is awesome. Plus, I think it probably makes me look even cooler when I'm driving it. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> but uh, I'm down to trade for the van if you want to do it. Awesome, let's do the paperwork. Cool. Gonna go on. Yes. This is the last time I'm in here. 
Trade done. Bye bye to the caravan. See you later. Didn't have it long, but there it goes. But we have V8 over here. Baby V8. Oh my god. So much power. Wow. Now this is what I'm talking about. That was a trade. <laughs> oh my god. So it's a 2009 Holden Caprice with a ridiculous 6 litre V8 that is loud enough to scare the pants off the average pedestrian. This car is not stock standard either. It's got 19 inch Simmons wheels with new tyres, 2.5 inch exhaust all the way through, professionally lowered with pedal suspension, cross drilled and slotted front brakes, a front strut brace and a small cam, and a DVD screen in the headrest, which are just a few of these upgrades that he's done. Now, I couldn't possibly be any more stoked with this trade. This car is worth far more than the caravan or the cash combined. This is probably one of our best trades so far with a $7,000 increase because this car is worth up to and over possibly $20,000, guys. Yes, let's do this. Click here to watch another video. YouTube thinks you're really gonna like it. And if you're into the videos and you wanna support the channel, join our community and connect with us. Don't forget to join the coin hunt. Details in the description.